Hi right, guys, welcome back. Another camp out. So we parked the car just over there, about 25 metres away. So we bought quite a bit of gear today. So we have a nice camp out, a couple of lavoos, Dutch oven. And we're heading over in that direction. Found a nice clearing over there. So we just got to lug all this gear through and then we'll start setting up camp. And I'll show you stage by stage our setup. So onwards and upwards. So we bought a lot of our kit this weekend as the car's not too far away so it's kind of like a car camp so have a lot of luxury it's nice having all the luxuries in the winter so becky's just bringing up the rear the last trip buster's got his pack on So that's roughly where we walk from with all this kit. So it's, it's going to be a nice camp. So there's two nights we're going to do. So prepare camp, get some firewood, dig a fire pit, have a nice chilling time. We even bought our crocs and sliders, haven't we, Bex? Yeah. Personally, uh, I don't think we have enough here. <laughs> We can always go back and get the kitchen sink, can we? Yeah. We chose this site. It's quite a nice clear site. And uh, no deadfall and lovely distant views. So I think we'll be quite comfortable here for two nights. We'll get our matching hats. We're looking good and we got our matching oh, yeah. life boat stickers. Yeah, we donated 70 pence. Becky was a bit more generous than me. She put 50 in and I put 20. So we got our lifeboat stickers. I think they do a good job. The old lifeboat people, don't they? Risking their lives to save others. Yeah. So we're gonna crack on now, get some of this kit set up and we'll show you as we're going through the stages. So I'm thinking of setting up in this kind of area, possibly having a fire pit here, and I think Becky's going over. Five miles that way. <laughs> yeah, Becky's going over her area. So we're gonna set our lavos up. Becky's bought her lavo. Come here, Becky, let's have a look at that lavo you got. Show everyone. So Becky's fallen in love with a lavo. So she went and bought one. Where did you get it? Military Mart. Military Mart, how much? 30 quid. 30. I think that was including postage. 30 as well. pounds, you got the full kit. Let's see the bits you got with it. Did you get the full kit? Oh, they're in my bag. Oh, she's got the pole the and, and the pegs with it. Pole. So that's really nice quality one as well. It's, it's better quality than mine. So this yeah. is the small, is it? Yeah, size so small. Anyone that wonders what sizes are, oh, you'll see Becky's when she puts her up, hers, hers up, that the size is small. They do three sizes, small, medium, large. I think I've got a medium and a small combined together, so. So yeah, it's in good condition, that one. Yeah, really nice. So where are you thinking of going, Bex? I'm scouting around. Scouting around. And we got a nice tabletop. flat, yeah, tabletop and a nice flat surface for wood prep. So that'd be good. Might go there, a bit of where are you gonna go? Like. You're gonna go here, there, are you? Where you're standing? Mm. The ground's a bit like that, isn't it? I might go here. Sounds good, looks good. So that's your kit you got with your with your tent, is it Becky? Yeah, these are the the uh, the collapsible pal. Oh, that's quite good, I didn't get that with my kit. And the pegs as well? Yeah.
So nearly set up guys. How's the lavo? Quite roomy, is it about mm. the same size as mine? I think it is. I think yours might be a bit bigger on... I think you might have a small and a medium. So very nice. And we're thinking about having the fire where that shovel is. Be quite nice. One fire pit, guys. Becky's off collecting firewood. Nice timber, is it? Burying me. Yeah. Yeah, nice fire pit. Very nice. That'll keep us warm. So I'm just collecting some nice pieces of kindling a million miles away from camp. So I'm just snapping these off. That'll be uh a nice start to the fire. I'll get some of this for the wood burner as well. And Becky's over there. Cutting with our new silky. She's just like a kid with a new toy. How's that silky, Bex? She's loving it, I better not stop her. She can do a couple of hours of that, it'd be excellent enough wood for the whole weekend. How's that silky? Very nice. She likes that. She's a happy girl. See a lot of girls. Diamond rings and they're happy. Get Becky a silky and she's very happy. takes a while to set up, get organised, but I think we're almost there. That's a stunning woodland. And Buster's in a world of his own. Becky's sparking up the fire, get a nice hot brew on. The wind's slightly picked up so it's getting a bit chilly. Well we're nicely set up now, got some nice cut logs 
and we've got a load of scruggy pieces to back up and then we've got a few split pieces in here with some logs and a wood burner that should keep me uh, going for tonight and also we brought some uh, some coal as well, should be quite nice. And they're quite stealthy, the old uh, the old laboos. for that nice uh, brew Becky's making. It'll be the first brew of the day, wouldn't it? Apart from this morning. Oh um, yeah, it will. It's so, no, there's a nice bit of wood about. So we haven't been here before. This is our first time here. It's a new location. So we thought we'd uh, have a little camp out. It's a bit of a stealth camp, really. Uh, a woodland not too far from us so we thought we'd uh, bring all our bits and pieces and uh, try a different location you know and with the car quite close as well it's been uh, you know quite spoilt for bringing bringing all your bits which I really like you know I want to get into that a bit more Lovely location though, isn't it, Becky? Yeah, it's gorgeous. Really we don't really uh, camp in beach woodlands, do we? No. All around it's beach trees. No, so it's quite nice. And it's a bit warmer this weekend, so I think we're having a mild, mild spell, and then it's cooling off. I think it's about four tonight, four or five tonight, and then a bit milder tomorrow. No, it's gorgeous. Getting a bit hungry as well. Are you? Yeah. Not after all them Scotch eggs. Well, I had a Scotch egg, egg each. <laughs> but you certainly burn some calories, you know, wood prep and cutting the bits and pieces in. Got about half a tonne of gear. <laughs> <laughs> oh, where there's smoke, there's fire! It's been damp as well, so it's going to be a quite a smoky fire. And we worked it out that I'll be probably getting quite a bit of smoke in mine, so. As we looked at the wind before we set up, but I quite liked where I was. Oh yeah, I am getting smoked out. That's another thing to consider when you're setting up camp. Yeah, she's heading in there, isn't she? She's smoking. So that's me uh, Christmas present there guys, my Dutch oven. So I'm well pleased with that. It's a Petromax one. So I'll be cooking in that this weekend. I'm just going to do a 
couple of pies and some potatoes in it tonight and then tomorrow we're going to have a nice breakfast so it'll be good fire's nice now is that warm Becky yeah drying off my oh yeah your knees, knees where you've been leaning yeah oh it looks good it's really cool we'll warm that oven up and then we'll heat them pies up with with some potatoes and we've got a tin of beans to throw on it so nice easy dinner tonight Becky's right what are you writing down there Becky um well I decided for this year I'm going to list all the camp outs I do so I can just uh, remember each camp out it's like the dates and that and then uh, I'll write down write the a number journal no, that's camp good. out so you can look back at old memories oh that'd be nice yeah see what you do cool you're gonna have to move soon the old flame is oh, getting yeah. high oh that's nice isn't it Very nice guys. Mm. <laughs> the Buster's got a bit bit of food left over, so he's had that. That was a lovely meal, wasn't it? Enjoyed that. That's beautiful that was. That chicken tikka pies and the potatoes and the hot beans. Really nice. Wash it down with a nice brew now. That's been a good day. And I'll spark that wood burner up soon. It's getting a bit nippy. The fire here is nice though. Oh, we look quite red. Can I? It's either fire burn or wind burn. It's definitely not sunburn. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> the question is who's washing up? Becky's making herself a nice hot chocolate. A bit partial to that, Becky, now, aren't you? How many scoops of that do you get? Get through. <laughs> One. <laughs> two. There she goes. Three. <laughs> Is it going to be four? No. no, it's three. <clears throat> three hot chockies. Do you all sorted for tonight? Yeah. Everything all prepared? Little Buster's got... Little Buster's in with you, and he? Got a good setup tonight. Should I say Big Buster? <laughs> you've lost the wood burner, but you've gained the dog. Yeah. So he gives off heat, doesn't he? Yeah, he's got a roll mat, wool blanket, mm. and a, another blanket. Looks quite posh in there. And, a, and an air bed as well, so... Beautiful. That's the thing when you come camping, you've got a dog, you've got to allow for all his bits as well. It's a 
bus has been non-stop today, haven't you? You see, <laughs> now he's off again. <laughs> You've already seen him. Chatting, he? <laughs> You've already seen him. No, quick appearance and he's off again. Oh, it's lovely for a dog though, isn't it? Freedom. That's what they love. Not being hemmed in all the time. Cheers, Bex. Cheers, guys. So in the Lavu now guys, beautiful in here, luxury, it's about 4 degrees outside and about 25 in here I think, so I'm going to get in my bag and uh, get my head down, so I'll see you in the morning guys, oh, you can see the glow on my face from the heat, beautiful. So a nice bit of timber in here, keep that going. And then once I fall asleep, that's me done. And then spark her up in the morning for a nice morning brew. Morning guys, just got up, so I've got a kettle on, wood burners, nice and warm, a lovely cosy night last night, it's about half past five, and I'll uh, <coughs> sit here, keep warm, get a brew on and uh, watch the sun come up, I'm listening to the owls. Beautiful noise. Twit to Twit to So I've done most of the wood as well, so be wood prep today. Oh, probably after breakfast. But no, loving it. Becky's still asleep. Just getting a few more Z's. It's luxury in a wood burner though. I'm just sitting by it, look. If you haven't got a wood burner, guys, and you like winter camping, oh, this is luxury. Awesome in the Lavu. Really nice. It just traps all the heat in there. Couple of logs out of the wood burner and put it on the main fire. So I've got the main fire going now. Nice bit of heat for Becky when she gets up.
Sun's coming up. How was your night then, Bex? Um, I didn't wake up as usual. Slept right through? Yeah. Did you? I got up a few times, sparked the wood burner up. Nice morning though. Did you get up at five or something? Yeah, five and just get the wood burner going. For my second brew. Lovely though, isn't it? Gorgeous. Brand new day. So we're out collecting wood again, guys. Build up the wood stores, what we burnt. Then think about breakfast, I think. So I'm just waiting for that breakfast now guys, so that was onion, sausage meat, hash browns and uh, put eggs over the top, I forgot the cheese but next time I do it I'll sprinkle some cheese on the top, so I'll let that uh, cook away now and uh, try that out, starving, and the kettle's on, beautiful.
topics. Mm. Enjoy. Enough about ten here. Very nice guys. So thanks for watching and we're gonna continue this on Becky's channel, Girl Outdoors. If you wanna put watch part two, it's over on her channel. But this is oh beautiful. So thanks for watching guys, enjoy the great outdoors, and I'll see you on the next one. Cheers, I'm gonna enjoy this. <laughs>